guys, welcome back to my channel. Today, wow, it's been a minute since I filmed in this room. I've been doing like videos in like other locations for like at least a week now. So I am pretty much almost fully ready, except for like, I don't have eyelashes, blush, bronzer, highlighter, lips on. So it's kind of like, those are like the finishing touches. So I wanted to do like a, um, a little review and demo of the new Pat McGrath highlighters. These are the, let's see, what, what are they called? These are called Sublime Skin Highlight Trio. This is a highlighter palette. It comes in this really, really cute packaging, and I actually love it. It doesn't come in a box or anything. This is just how it is packaged. It comes exactly like this. There's no unit carton. So you just open it like this. It has her logo right here. I just am absolutely obsessed with Pat McGrath's presentation and everything like that. So these are the highlighters. I have used them already. I've tried them. So you've got um, two kind of pearl shades, one with a pink undertone, one with a yellow undertone, and then a bronzy one, which I actually haven't swatched that one. So I'll swatch them for you now. This is what it looks like. This is the pink one. These are kind of like, you guys can see, they're pretty much translucent, like the white powder doesn't show up, it's just like that kind of pink tone, and they're not like blinding, it's more of like a very natural type of glow. This is the gold yellow undertone pearl one, and then this is the bronze one, which is stunning as an eyeshadow. Well, I haven't tried it, but I'm imagining it's going to be stunning as an eyeshadow. So. Those are the three shades, and let's see if they have names. Iridescent Pink, Fine Gold, and Bronze Nectar. So this is Iridescent Pink, Fine Gold, and Gold Nectar. Um, obviously, I wouldn't use the Gold Nectar on my face. I'm using a combination of these two, the Iridescent Pink and the Fine Gold. I like combining them, and I'm just dipping into both of them, and then I'll go on like the very tops of my cheeks. It's a very, very natural highlight. Like I'm used to now using like the Jaclyn ones, but it's still like super glowy. It's just like I wore these on a day I didn't wear any other makeup. Does that make sense? Like I wouldn't wear the Jaclyn ones on a day like that because it's like it'll, it would look a little off, but these kind of like melt into the skin very much so and also the tones of like the combination of like the yellow and the pink combined it's kind of like a perfect like t skin tone for me um, I'm still not going to take them down to the cheek bone like or the cheek area the apples of the cheek I still like to do my um mood light on that section just because I don't want to emphasize texture with a normal highlighter, even though these ones, I'm telling you, they just like melt into the skin. It's kind of crazy. But um, also for this, it's like, it's like a pinky because it's like kind of like a pinky tone. No, it's a very, it's very pretty. You don't see any frostiness. Like with the Jaclyn ones, you see some frostiness. That's what gives it's like, gives it the blinding, the blinding element. This is really just kind of like, flat on the skin in a good way in a way that you're just like it looks really natural but um i didn't like it for a highlight right here or right here because i don't know why it just it doesn't look right because you can really see the pink and the yellow tones so i still like to use my jacqueline ones for like my highlight right here it needs to be white the highlight here and here need to be really, really white and, and blinding in order to work, maybe because it's so precise. Also, the inner corner. This is more of like a skin glow, but this is more of like, you want that very, very high beam kind of look on like the absolute tips and points of your skin. But this is more of like a general area, even though this is still targeted. Does that make sense? So, um, yeah, my first impression is that like, they're very they were very natural and i was like am i even gonna be able to use these but yeah when you put them on your skin it's stunning i haven't used like them in any other way other than combining them and when i combine them i just love the look of it it's not too pink and it's not too yellow when you combine them here i'll do it in here 
Maybe, hopefully it'll come out, I don't really know. Yeah. So that's like when you combine them, it's like a nice nude color. So that's it, these are $50 retail, and um, I'll have to try like the Golden Nectar, like the bronzier highlighter in another video, because I already did my eyeshadow today. So that's it, you guys. I hope you enjoyed this video and found it useful. Please subscribe and please like this video and I'll see you guys in my next one.